Getting an erection involves the brain, it involves hormones, it involves muscles, nerves, and the circulatory system. They all work together to get blood pumping into the peen to fill erectile tissue that results in an erection. When this system doesn't work the way that it should, a man may have trouble getting or remaining hard. This is called erectile dysfunction. Erectile dysfunction is on the increase. What was once seen as a problem primarily faced by men over 40, stats now show us that more and more men under the age of 40 are dealing with this issue. It's no longer only regarded as something you would deal with as you age. Now there's a few reasons for this. It was once considered a psychological issue and by that I mean the result of mental health matters such as anxiety, depression, stress, life situations. Now we know more things can be drivers of this type of dysfunction. Things such as excessive alcohol consumption, excessive drug use. Research has proven that these things affect men hugely. Some other major contributing factors could include obesity. As we know, carrying excess weight impacts our body as a whole. Heart problems because, well, the pumping of the blood around the body by the heart is a crucial part of the erection process. And diabetes. Now, diabetes, in particular type 2, is on the increase because of individual lifestyle. High levels of glucose in the blood that comes with having diabetes can lead to damage of the blood vessels, which in turn will make it difficult to supply the necessary amount of blood to the pain in order to sustain an erection.